Now, police forensic experts are this morning expected to pick up DNA samples from families of the missing girls in Takwadi as they try to establish if remains obtained from the home of prime suspect Samuel Udotek Wills are theirs. Now, uh, he is suspected to have kidnapped the girls many months ago. Yesterday, acting IGP James of Hongbun visited families and secured their cooperation in investigations after earlier disagreements. The Director General of the Public Affairs Unit of the Ghana Police Service, ACP David Aklu, was has been speaking to join us as Israel I. It's to personally touch base with the families uh, since this is that happened because uh, uh, he's been receiving brief even though he's been receiving briefings and reports from the Western Region and the CID. And it was important that he personally took those steps to touch base with the four families. The second purpose of the visit was also to update the families on steps we have taken so far in the investigation and the critical need to seek the cooperation of the four families so that we can, through the scientific process, identify to the, those uh, remains that we found uh, in two places in Takradi. Uh, the third one was also to, to listen to their concerns because the families have, through press conferences and all that, raised some concerns about the police some aspects of the police work and sought clarity. So we also went there to, to listen to their concerns, clarify issues, and also take into account their, uh, their worries about certain aspects of police investigation. And lastly, a new liaison officer has been appointed to liaise with the four families. He is based in Accra here. He's the director of uh, our religious affairs, ACP, Reverend Father George Atta so that the liaison can be boosted with the most senior ranking officer who can work with the family. Now, is that, is that then to suggest that the police have won the cooperation of the four families involved for this DNA or the collection of some biological samples to go ahead? Yes, we visited all the families, the three, and then the mother of the fourth lady in Swaim. And the, the feedback is positive. Look promising. The family were reassured about the Inspector General of Police personal presence, and then they, they indicated that the presence of the IGP has boosted their confidence to participate in the process. Now, what's the latest update? I know that the police haven't quite abandoned the idea of finding these girls alive. What's the update as far as that is concerned? Um. We have to look at the various angles of the investigation. For now, we are treading cautiously. The case is still open until we finish the process of uh, going through the, and the DNA analysis to confirm whether those remains are those of the four ladies who went missing. We've got our eyes in Takrade. We would let you know uh, when please finally visit the family to pick up those samples and uh, other developments after.